All right, y'all. It's that time again. I am about to step on stage in like two hours to compete in a pole sport organization competition, pole fitness, whatever you want to call it. I'm competing. I am nervous, but not as nervous as whenever I competed in Dallas in June. So only a couple months ago, I'm going to bring that same routine to this stage, new and improved. And also I um, filmed my, I can't even talk, I'm so nervous. I also filmed my experience with my first pole competition a couple months ago. So it's on my YouTube channel if you wanna watch that after. Um, once you're seeing this, I've already competed. I already know what I placed and I'm just doing it for fun. Um, it's a very vulnerable sport and everyone in the crowd is just happy that, you know, we have the courage to just step on stage and show our tricks. <sighs> so I haven't eaten much. I had a small breakfast. Um, we're currently in Houston, like I said, so we got in late last night. Um, we've got our dogs here and it is just making me much more calm to have my two dogs here. Um, but yeah, so I can show you kind of the view of Houston. So that's kind of our view. So I've been able to enjoy this while stretching and getting ready. It's time for me to change and put on what I'm going to warm up my routine in and then I'll get into my costume and all of that or my uniform or whatever you want to call it. Um, but I've got my makeup done. I did it myself, so don't judge. Um, but normally I would have gotten already there. But last time I spent so much time backstage that I didn't get to see some of the girls that went before me go. So I wanted to get like 85% ready so I can enjoy at least some of the girls' performances before I go. So wish me luck. We're going to head there and I just hope. I hit every trick. I've got this. I've got this. This was my view backstage whenever I was getting ready to get on stage and perform my routine. And then this is what the audience looks at. You can see the videographer, the photographer, you can see the rig. And then those girls were helping us clean the poles. That's such a hard job and they don't get enough credit. And then this was right before I went on. So here we go. Please welcome Cinnamon from Extend Fitness Studio Ariel Ashley's Flexi Fit. I will, of course, be sharing with you guys my entire performance. It'll be on my YouTube very soon. And I just love to perform. This is such an amazing feeling. And if you haven't tried pole fitness, I highly suggest. And our gold medal goes to Cinnamon, representing Extend Fitness Studio. Pivot 108, Dramatic Level 3, Junior, Senior, our gold medal goes to... After my competition, I booked a session to go see my medical massage therapist so he could help my sore muscles after training for 18 weeks straight. And I actually have tons of life updates, so I'm going to make this video a vlog. It has been too long. I haven't picked up my vlogging camera for several days if not at least like two weeks or so. I have been competing in pole fitness competitions, running my business, getting my name out there, training dogs, training humans, um, and buying a house. So I have tons to catch you up on over the next couple of days. I'm going to be talking with you guys and catching you up. And um, I'm just super excited for this new chapter. I am actually, right now putting together some doggy gift bags because the city that I live in, they are having a doggy, like end of the year doggy splash day. And so they invited me to come and have a table out there and promote my business and pass out little gift bags and business cards. And so I'm just excited, but I need to get ready for that. I need to start packing because today I literally just found out that the appraisal went perfectly with the house that we are purchasing and 
there's no issues, everything is good, we're gonna close very soon, and then we're leaving the country. So, it's gonna be a lot, but I'm gonna catch up with you guys in a few seconds for you and a couple hours for me. It's officially time to pack. I don't know where to start, so I made some popcorn to help me think, and I'm nervous eating. Let's get this started. I'm gonna set you guys up on the air fryer. So I'm gonna start packing up just the small stuff and like some of the kitchen stuff that we have that we don't use and just one by one go. And even though we're, we are in a one bedroom apartment, we still have so much stuff. I don't know how we acquire stuff so quickly, um, but I'm excited. And getting boxes are kind of expensive. Like I wasn't expecting it to be as expensive as it was. I cannot wait to show you guys the house. I'm gonna do a house tour, of course. buddy say you stink from the gym and training all those dogs this is buddy one of my clients and his brother you'll hear him because he's crying in the crate but his brother has to be in the crate right now until I can shower and then supervise him out of the crate because he likes to come in here and tinkle on my things and we are not gonna have that we are gonna have a packing party tonight again and we're gonna eat some pizza from our favorite place and they only have one where we are, um, or close to where we are, and then they have one several cities away. So that's gonna be sad, but I'm sure we'll find new restaurants that we like. Um, we've talked to our realtor today, we've talked to our loan officer, everything should be good to go. So literally, this time next week, we would have already signed for the house, gotten the keys, and the house would be ours.